For this lesson, I'm using the project file 0503 sync locks and track locks. You'll find this project file with the media associated with this lesson. Just double click the file to open it in Premiere Pro. While developing a sequence, it's easy to click on something and make a change and then realize later you'd wanted it left as it was. Premiere Pro includes two ways to keep things as they should be on the timeline, and they become more and more useful as your sequence becomes more complex. In this sequence, we've got a few tracks with some visuals. There's some video clips, there's even some titles. We've also got a couple of tracks with music and voiceover. If I trim this first clip, this great forest shot, using the Ripple Edit tool, all of the clips after it are going to move. Not the music clip, because it begins before the edit that I'm changing. I'm just going to undo this. I can lock the tracks that I want to protect when I trim by clicking on these lock icons. But then I've got a problem, because if I drag to adjust the timing of this edit, I'm leaving behind these voiceover clips that I do want to move with my shots. So I'll just undo. I need these voiceover clips to move with my visuals, but I'm happy for the timing of the music to change. So I'm going to unlock the Audio 3 track, and now when I trim, these voiceover clips move as well. The reason why the voiceover clips are moving at the same time as my video clips is because of an additional feature called sync locks. Here's the toggle sync lock button for the Audio 3 track. I'm just going to undo, everything moves back, and I'm going to turn off the sync lock for Audio 3. And now when I drag to adjust the timing of this edit, the voiceover clips stay where they are. You'll notice that the audio for the one or two clips in the sequence attached to a video clip will always move because it's a linked audio clip. Here, this Temple from the Ground linked clip will always move with its audio. Unless, of course, linked selection is turned off in the timeline. 